It was a time of great adventure and danger. Shunned by his kin, an Illager wanders the land, seeking a new home. But all he found was hatred. Driven by rage against those who wronged him, he wandered blind to whatever end. Until at long last, the Illager found something that would change him forever. The Orb of Dominance. Corrupted by evil, driven by vengeance, the Arch Illager made all bow before him. And if they did not bow, they would fall. The Illagers raided the land. Who would have the valor? The purity of heart to stand against the Arch Illager's reign of terror. Well, not that one. But maybe you. Hola, welcome to Ghost Nation Ghost here, and today I'm playing Minecraft Dungeons, a re game that just recently uh, came out. I got very uh, curious to try it out, so looks like my screen is a little glitch for some reason. Don't know why, but... Uh, I'm gonna choose this guy. He looks... The most interesting. Okay. So it looks like there's uh you could do online games and offline. I'm going to probably do an offline game at first. Um real quick I'm gonna check my uh accessibilities, make sure everything is to how I like it. Yep. And my settings. Uh, we're going to turn down the music. By that much. Uh, turn that down by a little bit. Dialogue will stay up. Video volume will stay up. Yep, everything sounds good. Back out, uh... Tutorial hints, HUD scale. Okay, it looks like everything is alright. Back out. So yeah. This is gonna be an interesting game. Or it's some type of a dungeon crawler. Let's uh, get to it. I'll start my offline game now. Traveling to Squid Coast. Interesting. I say this load time is taking a little bit. Oh, there we go. The village is burning. No doubt this is the work of the evil Arch Illager and his minions. They sweep across the land like a ravenous scourge, subjugating or destroying all in their path. 
This is a time for heroes like yourself. Make haste. The villagers have need of you. Okay, uh, mysterious narrator lady. Interesting. So, it looks like L's like uh, left stick is to move, X is to attack, uh, tri square, triangle, and circle are s not able to be used yet. L1 looks like some potion that I might not, I'm not gonna use. I don't know what R2 does. Yeah, this is pretty interesting. Anything over here? I'm just... I think this is one of the first games of this type I've ever played, so I'm going to like explore everything I can. Looks like I can't, so I'm just going to move forward. Oh, it looks like there's a zombie. Takes one hit and it's dead. And Loki chose this dude because he has a he's the only one with a hood on. Wonder if there's a map we can actually uh, access at some point. What's this? Arrow bundle. Oh, so R2 is to fire arrows. Okay. Right now I have 39. Let's go this way, see what it is around here. Looks like nothing. So yeah, this is a pretty interesting game. Wonder if uh, I might make an actual series out of it. Don't know yet. If I say anything previously that contradicts what I'm saying now, we'll that's just me, but if I find this game enjoyable, yeah, I'll definitely uh, do a let's play. Ooh, supplies. Got bread, which heals me, and more arrows. for me. Ooh, I leveled up. Each level gives you an enchantment point. Each are used to upgrade items. Open the inventory to try it out. Select an item of your gear to uh, enchant. Now press triangle. Hmm. Sword or bow? I'm gonna do sword. Stunning. Stunning or sharpness? Um, I'm gonna do sharpness. All right. Well, let's keep going. You just picked up an artifact. Open the inventory to equip it. What is this? Equip artifact. Pick up a firework arrows in the artifact category to equip them. Looks like puts a firework arrow into your quiver. The arrow explodes on hit. 47 range damage. 30 second cooldown. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, I take it if I use square, it will actually uh, use it. Okay.
Okay. That's kind of cool. And there's a, just a cooldown, so. How do I get to the thing? I want the thingy. Oh. oh. Okay. Can I jump? I'm curious. Can you jump? No. Oh. Well, I just dropped. Okay, so you can dodge. It's a cooldown. Okay, I just used my potion to heal me by accident. Okay, I'm gonna see. Yes! Haha! -ha. Alright, what do I do? Uh, anything? Nope. Uh, hero cape. I will have baby chicken as pet. And I will have cake. Oh, there is a map. It's a down arrow. Okay. Makes you go slower, too. Actually, no, it doesn't. I lied. <laughs> Like we're gonna set up camp. You were too late to rescue the villagers, but don't fret. They're still out there somewhere waiting for a hero to find them. Hmm. Interesting. Traveling to camp. Level complete, Squid Coast, I've become level 2, I've taken only 16 damage, projectiles 73% uh, accuracy, and mob speed are 100. Looks like I get a free chest. Fishing Rod, trusted companion of any true adventurer. The fishing rod is useful for more than just fishing. Hmm. looks like oh okay so the map does take me around the place so interesting looks like there's a fortress biome something coming soon here of uh, the squid coast creeper woods whatever this is interesting interesting and this must be where I mission select. Looks like there's a sheep up there. What's this? Oh, it's just a practice. Okay. This is actually kind of cool. It's like a little mini hub for us to relax at. Alright, I think it's time for our next mission. Not to delay any further. And it looks like we're gonna go to the Creeper Woods next. Creeper Woods default one. So right now our power level is one, uh, and this one's recommended one. It looks like you could do easier, harder difficulties eventually. Hmm. I wonder what. Okay, this is just a tutorial. That makes sense. So it looks like we can do this bo this uh, level many other times. Interesting. All right. I wonder what the story is. A journey begins. The Arch Illager has come to power using the Orb of Dominance, turning the overworld upside down. 
Power is collecting in strange places. The undead are stronger and refuse to burn in the sunlight. And illagers are raiding the countryside. The illagers capture the defenseless villagers and move them east, towards their mysterious base in the redstone mines. The first step in their ruthless journey starts by going through creeper woods, a mob-infested maze of tangled roots and branches. Move quickly if you wish to save the villagers from a terrible fate. Okay. This is actually pretty interesting. It looks like there's a bunch of gear we can get and artifacts. I'm a, this looks pretty interesting actually, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, let's uh, start the mission then. So, it'll be up to uh, you guys to uh, say if you want more Minecraft dungeons. I'm probably going to play about an hour's worth and then see if you guys want to uh, have this be a series. But yeah, let's gotta continue as we wait for the loading screen. Hopefully the loading uh, times aren't massive, especially for offline modes. By the Arch Illager's decree, all free folk are now enemies of the Illager Empire. Somewhere in these woods, a caravan is transporting villager prisoners to labor in far off lands. Find the caravan and stop the illagers, or there's no telling what dreadful doom will befall our villager friends. Interesting. Now the map is even larger this time around. Oh, so if you hold it, it brings up a map. But if you don't... Okay. That's actually pretty interesting. Good to know. It allows me to explore the entire map. Ow. Good to know, good to know. Come at me, you bloody zombies. You're so easy to kill in this, surprisingly. No secrets over there. What is that? Make sure, making sure I do not miss a secret. As the completionist within me wants to make sure there's no secrets behind. Okay, you can actually go in water. That's good, that's good. Looks like you get one free uh, health thing per level. I'm not gonna use it though. Not that damaged I am. Oh, I knew it. Secret chest. 
picked up a sword. This does 10 to 16 melee damage. This one does 10 to 16. But this one, uh, this one has different enchantments. What kind of enchantments does it have? Fire aspect. And, ooh, and 20. This one is way better. But until I can upgrade, I will leave it in my inventory. Ooh, there looks like there's two different uh, areas to go. I will go this way first. Always go left. There's always secrets on the left side, usually. Oh! That was a whole lot of skeletons. Gotta do that bob and weave tactic. Oh god, there's so many of them. Run away. Aha. Oh god. Oof, that was a close call. Okay, real quick. I'm gonna use that to heal. Now I'm gonna look. An X. 16 to 24 damage. And what kind of enchantments it could do? 4% mob max health. Leeching, okay. Then there's prospect, 100% increased chance to find more emeralds. Slows mobs. Okay, so this is a pretty good weapon as well. I think I will use it for now. Just because it's stronger. But that other sword does have some pretty good damage to it. So I'm definitely going to use it. Uh, let's go here first. Looks like there's another chest. What's that? You picked up Hunter's armor. 5 plus health, 10 plus arrows per bundle, 30 plus range damage. Do we equip it? Yes we do. Bam. I'm more really I'm actually really liking this. Anything else over here? Nope. Okay, let's explore this last section before we continue onwards. Here, nope. Where's this lead? I have no idea where this leads. That's actually pretty interesting. Anything else over here? Nope. Actually, I'm gonna open the map. What does that mean? Huh. Clearly, it's not the main objective, so I'm gonna just go. This is a whole bot, a whole dungeon. Wow! So I I did this completely by uh, accident. Can I even get over there? Uh, maybe if I uh. Doesn't look like you get over there. Maybe there's something I have to press. Or grab that. Oh crap. Thank god I used this axe. Holy crap. I didn't expect so many enemies. Holy crap, I was not expecting that. So this is a weaker axe, but what kind of enchantments it does? Sharpness and Rampage. Hmm. Alright, what were the enchantments of this axe? 
Uh, Li Jing taking some of their health. Five more emeralds. Hmm. I think I'm gonna do leeching. Yeah, I'm gonna do leeching. Maybe I should have done the armor. What kind of armored? Frenzy, 10 plus melee, rage attack speed, 20% 20 20 chance to trigger, grants a small chance to deflect incoming projectiles. Pretty nice. And what about the arrows? Okay, okay. There's a lot of things that you can upgrade and stuff. Interesting. Wonder how many if there's a level cap or is there just infinite levels? If infinite levels, that'd be great. Cause that means you can upgrade about almost everything. I might be doing this by accident. I might not actually supposed to be here right now, but one must explore, become stronger. Not to be a hero in this game, I must become stronger. God, I actually really love this mechanic. Looks like this is another uh, uh, exit point. But I'm not gonna go there. I'll probably go back to the other exit point to uh, explore the other portion of the map. this lead. Looks like a dead end. Yeah, it looks like a dead end. Alright, where else is there to go? Down there. I really like this easy accessible map. I won't have it on screen all the time because that probably be annoying for y'all to look at. God, it's like this axe is pretty good. I'm actually enjoying this axe weapon a lot. Looks like there's another chest. And another bow and arrow. Just finding all the secrets. See, exploring in open world games like this, slash uh, dungeon type games, really pays off. Because you can get stronger by killing extra mobs, but also find rare items and stuff that you wouldn't have find if you didn't explore. Looks like that's all of the things in this, uh, dungeon I guess so I'm gonna return to the uh let me check these one rooms real quick nothing so we're gonna head back over to this boy real quick let me check the other arrow Looks like this one has three enchantments, and this one has two, only two, but it has a slight one extra damage. What, is, what are its enchantments? Pushback, six heal. Hmm. Interesting. And now we're back out here. There's a lot of skeletons here. For a place called Creeper uh, Forest or whatever, there aren't really that many creepers. Watch that backfire on me immediately. 
Oh no. I'm surprised there's no chest there, actually. Yeah, I'm surprised there's no chest there. Found all the secrets. But there's a couple extra chests. Wonder where they could be. Oh, there finally there's a creeper. And then there's another chest. Okay, let me check. Wolf armor. One health, 20 weapon damage, boost aura. Health potions heal nearby allies, which is not useful at the moment since I'm not playing with anybody. But it, and it is weaker. Huh. That's disappointing. Anything else? Nope. Nothing else. I fell. Must search the entire area. There was a creeper. Where was it? Where'd it go? You aren't going to escape me, creeper. Alright. Keep going to the right path now. Looks like I haven't found any other chests at the moment. Uh, is this a campfire? It is. More emeralds. Doesn't look like there's anything else over here. Oh, the health potion regenerates after a while. That makes more sense. Okay. search everywhere I must find all the things all of the thingies anything over here oh. must search all of the area oh there's a chest there's a chest aha uh -huh. Where is it? Over here? Haha. Oh, you only give emeralds your, your crap chest. You are a piece of crap. Yup, bloody. How are you gonna be a chest and not give me anything but emeralds? You are a piece of junk. That's what you are. Fuck you, skeleton. Fuck you. Fuck you. I aim like a stormtrooper. Great. Oh, how dare you shoot me. Yeah, take that. Anything over here? Nope. And I'm gonna heal. Once again, once again. Must a heal. Must a heal. I must search for every nook and cranny. Because I must have it. everything.
Oh shoot! First. Oh. Ooh, that's a close one. Oh, it looks like uh, you kill random animals. They give you uh food and stuff. That's actually kind of cool. Oh, now there's a whole crap ton of creepers. I'm sorry. I don't know why cow would drop an apple of all things, but you take what you can get. I suspect that there's things here. There is the thingy. Ha. Huh. Ooh, that's okay. Ooh. Ooh. Don't fall. I'm prone to falling. Maybe I'll try to get some of my friends to play this. It'll be probably pretty interesting for us all to play this. Or hell, maybe I'll even uh, do a community event. What is that? Nothing. It was just a potion. So many spiders. You ain't gonna leave my frickin' What? Oh, you can throw it! I didn't realize! Oh, that is actually cool. That is cool. What did it drop? Another sword. But it's weaker. That's sad. I am sad. But it looks like there's also another, uh... Unless that leads to, uh, the other entrance. Let me try it real quick. No, this is a whole different area. Wow, just some extra random area. That's cool. Alright then, let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Chest. Get me out! I got arrows for days, my guys and gals. I got arrows for days. Free the villagers. Will do, buddy. Will do. Oh, shoot. First, we're gonna go here. Do 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 do. Kill all the pillagers. Oh, did I just activate a tra a door? Interesting. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Yeah, you too weak to fight me. And I 
level up again. For you. Sorry. I'm gonna slaughter you all. I'm gonna free you. Kill you, kill you. Take that. Why do these things glow like they're important? Searched most of this area already, so gonna head. <laughs> Must search all of the things. Must search for all. Aha. And with that, they're all free. Now to deal with the last of the mobs. Come at me, bros. I'm sorry, I must slaughter the animals. I must consume their flesh. Ah, uh, what the hell is wrong with me? <laughs> What's up here? Oh. a secret. No, it's not. <laughs> Alright, let's check over here. Now that I'm not blocked. No secrets. I'm sad. That cow I thought was invincible for a second. Fuck you. Wherever that was, I killed it. <laughs> Kill you. Kill you. Smash that. Kill you. Kill you, kill you, and kill you. And now, kill you. Escape the creeper woods. Okay. Sure, I'll escape them. Even though I don't think I need to. Oh, why? Okay. Okay, we're in the way. Oh, God. I did not expect all that. I did not expect all that. Whew. Okay. Exit. These Victory. are free from the clasp of the illagers. All thanks to you. And we're traveling back to the camp. Okay. Killed. Uh, chest open, 100% healing done. 
damage dealt, projectiles. Hmm. What do we get? Boots of swiftness. Boots blessed with enchantments to allow for swift movements. Useful in certain times such as these. Hmm. And we use that. Bam. Okay. I'm gonna use my enchantment on one of my bows. I think I'm gonna do un unchanting as an upgrade. We did Creeper's Wood now, all these other places have opened up. Interesting. And it looks like there's a few more locations besides these four. There's also the Creeper Crypt. Interesting. This is so far I'm enjoying this game actually. It's pretty interesting. And there's a blacksmith. Uh you found fifty uh yeah, you found a chest with fifty emeralds. Interesting. And I take it Get a random piece of gear appropriate for your level. Make trade. Okay, so that's what we do with uh those. Is there anything else around here? Oh, there's a house of he in here. Anything up there? Doesn't look like it. Interesting. Well, I think I'm gonna wrap up this episode. Uh, this was a pretty interesting uh, game so far. I like it. I think it would be better if I had, uh, if I play with friends or people from either my, uh, YouTube community, my fellow subscribers and possibly YouTubers, or through a PSN community. That would probably, uh, it'd probably be better with a group of, uh, I think two or four. I don't know how many people could be in a group, but yeah, this would probably be much more interesting much more fun with a group of people but nonetheless it is pretty fun to my uh, my view it, it feel it's nice mechanics pretty simple action gameplay I really probably could dive in for hours at a time and play it but yeah it's pretty fun and yeah that's my general opinion if you guys want me to do a series with either by myself or with friends uh... let me know in the uh... comment in my uh... in the video for the video yeah <laughs> that's the best way i can say that if not i might continue it either way maybe i kind of find if i uh... get a group of people i probably will continue it as a series but i want to try to ask my audience if they would consider if they want me to continue with this so yeah hopefully you all enjoyed until next time this is ghost signing out